Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to another Adobe After Effects CS6 tutorial. My name is Buddy Blackford. We're going to be going over duplicating layers and how to rename layers and how to uh, replace layers, like uh, exchange them out. I uh, it's hot. It's hotter than Satan's nipples in my room right now because there's not a lot of ventilation and. I opened up the window and all of a sudden this guy started running a chainsaw outside so hopefully he doesn't do it in the middle of the tutorial I mean he hasn't been running the chainsaw all day so I mean it's like the perfect time for him I guess so let's uh, start with the tutorial the first thing I wanted to show you guys is how to duplicate layers and you use this a lot of times so it's a uh, handy to know the shortcut for this one I'll show you how to just duplicate it first. So let's click on the squish here. You go to edit and then duplicate. And now you have uh, another squish there. See, you can take them off and it appears right in the same position. The uh, hotkey, as you might have seen, was control D. So I can hit control D and you can hit it a bunch of times if you want. Now you got tons of them. So you can click on a layer and then click on a layer be below it holding shift and it will select all the layers in between or you can and yeah just hit delete and i mean i got rid i just wanted to get rid of all those you can select a layer and hold control to uh, select layers without selecting multiple layers without selecting the uh, ones in between if you don't want and uh, another cool feature is if you have these layers selected and you want to edit them and then the next layers you want to edit are the opposite ones you can right click and invert selection and now it'll select the other ones that you didn't that you didn't uh, mess with yet or that you didn't have clicked before I guess so the next option here we are going to uh, rename layers so the way you do that is you might think it's by double clicking but it's not if you double click a layer it brings you to, to the uh, layer panel up here so don't do that you need to press uh, enter on your keyboard press enter on the keyboard and then you can just type it in hello nurse and press enter there to get it back to what it was before Go back to editing it and delete everything you have. Press enter again and it'll go back to what the original name was. Uh, another cool feature that we have in After Effects is the ability to replace layers. So if I want to, let me uh, turn some of these things off so I can show you. Let's turn off the tuna and the picture. Oh, I'm on it. There we go. So I want to animate this layer and I'm going to add a couple keyframes on it position and we'll just move it over here and then I'll just move it one more time doesn't matter where, where I move it really so I'm going to you see it has a motion path there I'm going to replace it with this uh, MTV vector that I have so you hold down you click on the MTV vector you also click down here on what you want to replace and hold alt and drag from the project panel over top and it'll switch it out for you and what it what's cool about it is it kept all the keyframes that we had so that way you don't have to re-edit everything it looks like the parenting got a little uh, messed up so we'll just unparent so keep that in mind when you do it the parenting might uh, not work as well but let's see if we can reparent it yeah it just reparent it it's probably just a glitch in After Effects just reparent it and you're good another way to do that you can do the same thing click on the object you want to replace with in the project panel and then what you want to re be replaced down here make sure they're both selected hold alt 
you can just drag it right onto the comp right onto the comp panel there like I just showed you I'll do it again real quick they're both selected hold alt drag onto the comp and it can be anywhere and it replaces it so that I thought that was a really awesome feature that's uh, it for this tutorial it sounds like the chainsaw didn't go off which is uh, which is a uh, great I guess <laughs> That would have been cooler if it went off because they chainsaws sound pretty cool and I would have gotten mad and had to cut it out, but I don't have to. It's awesome. Thanks for uh, watching this tutorial. Thumbs up it if you liked it. Thumbs down it if you hate duplicating layers. So we'll see you in the next tutorial.